Hello, air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. This is a monthly reading for the month of April. It's a quick and general one, and I will put the timestamps for each sign below. And I kind of pull a collective at the end, so you can watch it right after the last sign. And we will start with Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. And it's a quick and general reading. So let's start with Gemini. Okay, Gemini, let's take a look at the stones. You have a lot of love stones, passion, desire. You have a closing up of a cycle that's been ongoing for a while. It could be a new financial beginning. For a lot of you, this could be a new job, business, a new um, venture is coming up too. So I see that. Um, I do see also this could be a new person. Honesty, integrity is showing up here as well. Creativity, decisions with love, and changes of how you feel when you open the heart to feel. So we are seeing a lot of that energy. Um, you, This is a very important time of manifestation. So manifest, uh, manifesting what you do want. I do see abundant energy here. And paying attention to the synchronicities, pulling things together. Um, this is a time to really express um, the gratitude for all the good fortune and that in your life. So counting your blessings is going to be very important as well. So that is um, an important um, message there too. There is an energy here that because they're kind of boxed in together, they, um, it tells me that you need to let it out, let things flow, and open the heart to feel. Okay, so there is um, a strong energy here um, with that too. All right, so there is an energy here that you need to accept some things. And these are like, okay, maybe mistakes. We kind of reviewed the past. Yeah, I made a mistake here, this and that. But finding the teaching in them and moving forward. You know, but it's full. Your um, wisdom is here. So it's taking all the lessons you learned and moving forward. Um, you have to put some boundaries up this month too and stand your ground. There's something that maybe you need to stand your ground on and keep moving forward. Um, know that you're very resourceful this month and you will have all the resources that you do need to. They're available for you. Um, Freedom is a choice. It's a decision you're going to have to make. Whatever it is that you need to break free from, you always have that choice. So I do see that energy coming through. I do feel that um, there is something that was carried on maybe from last, um, I want to say, season or past few months is showing up here. Now there is a strong new beginning and you're being able to create that too. There is some uh, focus on love here and relationships. So that's definitely coming into focus. But don't pre-assume anything because a lot of things are not going to turn out the way you thought they'll be. Okay, so there is that strong energy there too. Money is showing up too. Some of you may be dealing with property matters or long-term investments. Okay, um, so I'm seeing that for some of you, this could be um, a better job or a promotion is very possible as well. Um, taking your power back is extremely important. Making your own decisions, taking charge of your own destiny. So I do feel that um, energy as well. For some of you, could be dealing with um, power and... Um, powerful figures or people who are prominent in their fields. So I do feel that. And they can be helpful, but you can't be too scattered. Um, there could be a choice you have to make between two jobs um, or where to invest your finances. So I do see that. Don't burn the candle at both ends of the stick. I do feel that energy as well. You're going to have to balance your home life and um, playtime and uh, work and money there's a, a few balancing acts here that you're going to have to do this month. A lot of opportunities and offers are coming your way, and there could be some good news with money coming in as well. You have opportunities. You have new beginnings. This is with love, money, and career. So we are seeing a lot of that energy. Don't pre-assume anything because not everything is going to turn out the way you thought it will be. So this is definitely a month of taking your power back. Let go. Let it flow. And open your heart to definitely feel things. Um, so definitely seeing that and being very, very, very grateful for the things that you do have. So decisions with love is showing up as well. All right. So that energy is definitely showing up. Okay. Now we're going to move on to Libra. Libra. This is a beautiful stone, but it's on the side. It's your wish stone, luck, fortune, 
climbing the ladder of success. Having you beginning, but there's two directions here. Which way to go? Or divide it between two things. There's a focus on home and foundation, something negative. There's almost like two homes. I don't know. I've been seeing that with Libra. It's like you're back and forth somewhere. Um, but this energy is one is negative and one is um, there's a, sp a need for spirituality. Okay. Um, a lot of creativity as well. So we are seeing that kind of energy. Um, you are very attuned um, this month too. So follow your intuition. Also, you have a very sensitive side this month. You could be more, more sensitive, uh, being sensitive to people and you could be collecting the emotions of others. So make sure you don't have a leaky aura as well. So it's like you're, you're picking up vibes from others and it's almost like too empathetic, you know, when you pick up that vibes. Uh, cooperation is key this month though and making strong spiritual connections. Need to balance and put things in alignment. Um, trusting your intuition when making some kind of decisions. Okay, so I do feel that energy is very important this month. Uh, pay attention to your dreams. Pay attention to your visions because that is um, important to look forward to. This is a time to also be empath empathetic, yes, but don't draw in anyone's energy. You know what I mean? Um, speak less, listen more is what I like to say. Okay, spiritually and with others around. Um, there is a little bit of energy here needing to lighten up at times It's and be happy and um, just focus on happiness and joy and connecting to nature. There is a good clear out, okay? Purifying things, needing to clear things out in your foundation. So clearing out clutter. I'm talking about real clutter, you know, arranging things, cleaning things up, emotional physical, mental, psychological, every which way, even tangible, the home, the office, your car, whatever, there is an important need to purify and to clear out. So we are seeing um, that energy too. I do feel that there will be some kind of um, gathering. Um, there could be some dating, going out, enjoying your time. There's um, that energy socializing now, there is someone in your inner circle that you need to take your power back with, okay? This person may be promising heaven and earth or if you, you know, this could be like years upon years for some of you and this person's just been promising something, well, you know, time to pay the piper or collect, you know what I mean? So there is that and this person is like, their heart is like closed down, I want to say. They're just very, you know... It's almost kind of too charismatic or pretending to be. So I'm seeing that kind of energy. It is time to take back your power there. Okay. Um, I do feel also that there will be a lot of new beginnings and a lot of the energies now will come to a conclusion or some kind of ending or a collective um, achievement by fall, which would be around mid-September and on. Okay. So I'm picking up that energy. Um, there's uh, messages are going to be important. This could be also bright ideas, news. You could be dealing with the child, almost like a fire sign energy. Um, um, there's a lot of fire here. Um, also for some of you, like I said, um, this is a time to, um, be true to yourself, speak your truth and move forward. You could be dealing with somebody who, um, can be a VIP or someone in authority. Um, this also person is, it's for some of you may not be telling the whole truth, but in between their actions, their words, you know, if you analyze it like a profile or would, you would see what the truth is. Okay. So I do feel that energy. You have a wish fulfillment. Okay. Very happy energy. A wish will come to fruition. Happiness. Anyone who has a question out there, this is going to be a yes answer. And I do feel here there is um, new people, new experiences coming through. This is also a lot of adjustments, movements in the home and foundation. This could be renovations, um, in and out type of energy. But following your dreams is going to be very important and paying attention to your intuition. This is a good clear out here as well. Okay? And making some strong decisions. All right, and that concludes um, 
Libra. Now we're going to move on to Aquarius. Oh, Libra. I forgot to mention this. This is also, this is where I was talking about, so I didn't show you, is going into fall. This is also um, money, love, family. It takes a little bit of time, okay? And this could be a return of energy. Maybe it is where you lived before or where people you were before, maybe um, going back to that or there's some rewards of reviewing things, okay? Now we go into Aquarius. <laughs> All right. Okay, so Aquarius, you do have some doubts here. Um, spiritually and emotionally um, connecting, and this is also loyalty. Um, a new spirit, a spiritual person should be coming through. This is a new beginning here. You have, you're spiritually evolving. There's changes, belief systems, um, evolution. So we're seeing that luck, love, family, money, it's there. There is a heart here to um, someone from the past. It's like maybe um, you've been estranged with, but your heart is still holding on. So we are seeing that energy it could be family or anyone, but it could be a, a focus on someone from the past and coming back. Now, there's a lot of love and compassion here as well. So that is very important, too. Um, this is a strong month to focus on your self-esteem. There's a lot of creativity and a lot of pos um, positivity as well. So being more optimistic and creative is going to be very important. Now, know that you are definitely here for a purpose. You have a lot of spiritual stones, okay? This is learning, realizing what matters to you. So you may have a change of mind, perspective. So what is the things that really, really matter to you? You're learning and you're realizing what matters to you most, okay? You have to own your own power. You have the power to manifest. Um, some of you may be dealing with, um, I don't know, this is maybe doing spiritual, um, magical spells or someone um, may, um, you know, I don't know, someone could be dwelling into that. But this is owning your own power. Um, know that you're safe and protected. It's like you almost feel like your, your stability could be shattered. Um, there's a need maybe to protect your own children, kin, or someone. I don't know. I'm feeling that energy kind of overprotective. Or you feel like you have to take this guardianship here. Um, you know, it's a general reading. Um, there is an energy of letting go of control and just see how things pan out. And it's important for you to free yourself of any kind of shame or some kind of guilt. There is a sense of, fe of feeling that energy. That I'm, you know, I'm reading what I'm seeing collectively here. Um, <clears throat> I am seeing here, pay attention to your surroundings, though. There is some negativity here and um, realizing what matters. There could be the people around you or that that have been using you, taking advantage of you for some real purpose, for their own real purpose. Are they really there just because they love you or, and they, you know, from the thick and thin, or they have a motive. So there is something to look at and to be, um, to kind of see what matters, okay? A lot of your fears and worries are going to be leaving you. I do feel there could be some good news coming in too, okay? So that's showing up. Very hopeful energy, wish fulfillment, dwelling into prayer, and you can manifest too. Prayers will be answered, okay? What do you need to cut out? And, and this is a change of belief and perspective is important. So this is like cutting out people or situations out of your life as well. And then moving forward, all right? They're not on the same path as you. They, you don't need this kind of energy, uh, that kind of energy. You need people who are thick and thin with you. Um, I do feel also that you are attracting so much better better energy you're putting your foot down and you have this vision an idea that could be something good with work some of you may be dealing spiritual doing spiritual work or massage therapy or even um you know re, um, re, 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 rehab or something you'd be doing really well there i see some of you doing that there is definitely um fears and where you need to break free, okay? This is like what I was saying, freeing yourself of some kind of shame or guilt. It's time to move forward, okay? Letting go of that energy and any manipulative people or anybody who just kind of drags you down, that needs to be cleared. So you're definitely here for a purpose. You're learning and realizing what definitely matters this month for you, okay? So when I'm looking at everybody here, um, air signs collectively, you have a strong energy. I feel there's going to be some official agreement. Some of you may be dealing with court. This documents are uh, big. Um, um, 
This could be signing contracts um, or just verbal agreements. It's a time to um, count your blessings, be grateful. There's a lot of fortune this month. You can manifest, pay attention to all the synchronicities. You definitely have abundance here. Um, I do feel cooperation and diplomacy is important, making the connections that are important for you, uh, creating a balance, adjustments, and alignment, mm -hmm. trusting your gut instincts and your intuition, especially when you're making some choices and decisions, make them about you, what's important in your life and what matters. Um, more optimistic energy, very creative energy, and um, more positivity here too. All right. That concludes it for the air signs and the um, timestamps will be listed below. Have a great month. Bye for now.